from Water City to the Cloud Buster, Chicago's Children's Museum has so much fun to offer every day. And now it's bringing back costumes, concessions, <laughs> and even <laughs> acrobatics with its iconic Circusville exhibit just in time for spring break. Now, Natalie Bortoli is with us this morning to tell us all about it. Natalie, yes. thanks so much for being with us. Thank you for having me. Okay, first off, congratulations. Best 10 Children's Museum in the country. Okay. It's awesome. Yeah, you, this is not news to you. You already knew this. <laughs> they know we're pretty great, but we're really honored by that recognition because it came from readers. It comes from users of the museum, folks who know and love the museum, not only from our local Chicagoland community, but across the country and around the globe. And I love what we have behind you, the Circusville yep. exhibit. So last time I was there, I did not see this. What yep. is the Circusville exhibit? Well, you know, everything we do at the museum really centers on connecting, learning, and play. So Circusville is no exception. This is a chance for kids to play and, in fact, to role play and pretend play. So they can take on all of the personas and characters of people who come together to bring a circus to life. So... You know, it helps to dress the part. Yes, if you're take on a role, right? yes. So we have a few of our. Uh, Sarah's dying to get over I here and put this on. I'm seeing I this tell. over here, and I'm like, <laughs> I could just picture me like, yeah, we're doing it. Like, this is the stuff my you kids love. Oh, They're obsessed yes. with dress up and the tickets and every part of it. Absolutely. Sorry, now it's like now it's, it's rolling away. away. Good day. <laughs> so yes, lots of props, ways for yeah. kids to play out different scenes, different roles. Be the hot dog vendor, oh, selling the food, so cute. dressing up, being a performer. Well, you know, I could do that. I yes, could how cute is this? Check it out, Here the Palazzo cart. But the you. best part about the museum, too, oh, thank thank you. You. is it's mm -hmm. kind of just, you dip in where you dip in, right? Mm -hmm. And it's never too crazy because there are just so many things to do in so many yeah. spaces that you actually have the time and the space to get creative. That's exactly right. You know, I feel like there's something for every type of child, yeah. every type of learner, whether you want to be creative and use your imagination or you're a problem solver and you want to go to our tinkering lab and think like an engineer and build something and construct something. I mean, it has to be such a relief for a parent because you're usually you're saying, don't touch that. <laughs> don't mess with that. Put that down. Yeah. But yes. at the museum, it's like, go play. It's hands-on everything. Go play. That is the way children make discoveries about the world, right? Is using all of their senses, putting their hands on things, understanding how the world works. Well, let's talk about some of the other things you have going on. You have a, you know, a water city exhibit. You've also got a Hebrew Brantley's art studio. Yes, yeah. And you know, I think one of the things that really ties all of our experiences together is we are a very Chicago-y institution. We yeah. look and feel like Chicago. And so many of our exhibits, like the ones you mentioned, really um, in, are inspired by and nod to some of the things that makes our city great. So Water City, the water tables are the three branches of the Chicago River. There's a beautiful Wait sky. Wait a sec. I didn't yeah. even realize yeah. that. <laughs> I stood there for like 35 minutes. Now wow. you know. Yes. Okay, yeah. I get it now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. And, gee, you mentioned Hebrew Brantley. Yes. We were so honored to oh. work with internationally renowned and Chicago-rooted artist Hebrew Brantley to design our art studio as a space where kids' imaginations can really soar. Um, our Cloudbuster. Yes, tell me about Cloudbuster. This is a 37-foot climbable sculpture. Mm -hmm. I promise there's nothing like it anywhere else. <laughs> and it is made of the types of materials that have built our city. It's structural um, steel and wood. And, you know, kids find their paths through it and really choose their own event adventures along the way and find their way to the pinnacle by the way, that is modeled after a Chicago apartment at the top. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, very cool. I love every bit What's of it. the most popular part? I feel like right when you walk into, there's the firefighter. You can get oh. dressed up as a firefighter. The kids yes. love that. They sure do. We, in fact, we have a piece of signage by that fire truck that says to parents, you're still at the fire truck, that's okay. Because it means when kids keep returning to something and spending that yeah. much time there, they're still getting something from it. They're still oh. learning from that process. I love this too. A lot of history here, right? Over 40 years, it's hard to believe. Yes, we were founded in 1982. So we recently um, celebrated our 40th anniversary. Mm -hmm. We've been part of the fabric of Chicago's cultural life for over 40 years now, specifically serving our, our youngest residents and visitors from all around the world, zero to 10 year olds. Goodness. And how long will the Circusville part be with you guys? Yes, this will be with us through oh. September 7th. So through there's September. still some time to come explore. And in fact, during spring break, coming up this last week yeah. of March and beginning of April, we have a number of um, Chicago youth-based um, circus arts organizations oh, coming so in cool. to run special programming where kids can engage with real circus they arts They said even acrobatics, so there you go. Yes. All kinds Look at of these kids. Things. They are living their best life. This is amazing. Gee, they we would tear are. it up there, Listen, too. Do, would you like a fry? <laughs> you can have 
have a fray. These frays are I'm, I'm very good. <laughs> they were delicious. This is the best. I love <laughs> it. For more information on Circusville, head to chicagochildrensmuseum.org. You can find them on the socials at well, Chicago Children's Museum. I cannot say enough good things about this place for anyone with children.